அதான் ப்ரோ அதான் முழுங்க You just witnessed some uh, visuals of the manner in which people in certain areas of Jaffna obtain water for their day-to-day -day needs. Now tonight's news first takes an in-depth look at the difficulties faced by the people of Jaffna in obtaining water. For three decades, Jaffna was battered by the war. Normalcy has finally returned to the livelihoods of the people in Jaffna. However, one of the major obstacles that they face is the inability to obtain clean water. Over 650,720 persons residing in Jaffna solely depend on well water to fulfill their drinking water needs. The water obtained from the well bottom too is not suitable for consumption. The water tastes salty, therefore it is difficult to drink. It is even more difficult when it comes to washing clothes. We are helpless. We have to purchase water. We want water to be supplied to the houses. 29 small tanks supply water to the Jaffna Peninsula, but this too has been restricted to just two hours. Coastal areas in the Jaffna Peninsula are the most affected areas due to this crisis. மழைக்கு <laughs> Senior lecturer at the Faculty of Agriculture at the University of Jaffna, Dushanti Mihundan says that the water crisis in the Jaffna Peninsula has been prevalent since the 1940s. She pointed out that the numerous institutions, including the National Water Supply and Drainage Board, the Department of Health and the Intellectual Committee of the University of Jaffna have carried out tests and investigations over this issue. The final outcome of all the tests and investigations carried out was that water needs to be supplied to the Jaffna district. In the Jaffna Peninsula, there is no water available on the surface of the earth. Therefore, the water that is buried underground is taken for use. We conducted a study regarding this water crisis over the past six years. We identified four key issues over here. That is the high concentration of salt, the high concentration of nitrate in the water and the high density of water. However, these issues were not identified in one single area but in different areas. When certain people in Jaffna cry for water, there are some who say otherwise. <laughs> The people in Jaffna are facing a crisis over water. However, this is not an issue faced by the entire district. In some areas, the people find it difficult to obtain water for their drinking purposes. It is in this backdrop that the debate of supplying water to the Jaffna Peninsula from the Iranamadu Reservoir came to the fore once more. We will be taking a look at that situation tomorrow. Sudha, Tehiravatta Samagin, Aditya Jawadana News, First Twin Win, Yapani City.